Only on Way 31, volunteers from the Decatur Church of Christ are on the ground working to help Selma tornado victims. Way 31's Nicole Zedek followed volunteers in our Storm Tracker 31, powered by Lynn Layton Chevrolet. She has a look at the destruction in Selma as crews work to rebuild a neighborhood torn apart. This is just a glimpse of some of the damage here in Selma. Volunteers from the Decatur Church of Christ traveled hundreds of miles to be here in this neighborhood and help residents pick up the pieces from the tornado damage. It just makes you feel really warm inside that somebody cares so much to come out and I'm God be with them. Looking around Joanne Radford's neighborhood in Selma, she says it's completely unrecognizable. The scenery here is different. Even the volunteers didn't expect this much damage. It blows my mind just looking at what's around us right now. I'm surprised there's not houses crushed by some of these trees. It's like they fell like Tetris blocks and just missed everything. That's one thing Joanne is counting her blessings for. Even with all this damage, no one in her neighborhood was hurt. I'm just grateful. Uh, nobody's gotten hurt. Nobody's gotten killed. And we're just, we're just good Lord took care of us. Now it's time to rebuild her neighborhood. This is probably going to be at least a few weeks of us trying to come down here and help. Volunteers from the Decatur Church of Christ say the distance doesn't matter. When people need help, they'll be there. There's people in need, and if I was in need or my kids or my wife was in need, I would hope people would come and help them. Reporting in Selma, Nicole Zedek, Way 31 News.